Hey friends, I just took out money to the vet, you know, getting her ready and you know, I wasn't really thinking, but you know, of course I wore all black and if you have a German Shepherd or you've been around a German Shepherd before, you know that they shed a lot. They're fun, they're beautiful, they're loyal, they're brave, but they're messy. You know, and um, we have to understand that if you want to love something, if you want them to love you back, in between all that love, there's always a little bit of mess. You know, but we also have to understand that, you know, in the International Space Station, when we go up into space and the astronauts go up there for days, some go up weeks, some go up months, you know, they have to actually daily clean the vents in the, Ash the International Space Station because, you know, the dead skin cells on the planet itself is gravity. So, you know, these dead cells usually just float around and go on the floor and, you know, on our clothes, some blow away into the air and eventually go back into the planet, you know, but in the International Space Station, there's no gravity. So every day, these 200 million an hour cells that die off, they fall off into the air, you know, into the environment. So that's about 5 billion dead skin cells a day that we let go, that falls off our body. And these guys in the International Space and didn't clean these vents, they wouldn't be able to get the fresh air that they valuably need out into that vast, dark universe. You know, so every day we get to be new, almost. You know, we have this new body, this new skin. And you have to understand or really dissect why is nature telling us that these dead cells have to fall off for new ones to grow? And in order for the new ones to grow, the dead ones have to fall off and float away, right? Because we want to be clean and fresh, like snakes, you know? Snakes grow out of their bodies, so their skins eventually fall off because of the expansion from eating and growing, and then they grow new skin. So everything's always growing every day. So what I want you to do is think about today as, hey, all my life, every day, I have a new body, a new set of skin, new cells. So if that's the case, I want you to make sure you apply your life to that. When those dead skin cells are gone, your past is gone, today is new, you have new skin cells for a new you to create a new you today so what do you want to do with that gift i mean go create the new you because the past you is gone and this new you with this new skin is waiting for this world to become better so go out there and change the skin on the earth go and help fix replenish clean because like everything we're all dropping off the old us and we're creating the new us or the new you. So let's remember the earth does the same thing. It's always creating new earth and deleting old earth. I believe, you know, if we take care of our body and eat the right things, just like the earth needs to be able to be cleaned and it's always creating a new earth. Well, if that's the case, can we slow it down? Because we could sure speed it up. Just remember these words. And again, <laughs> learn about your planet, learn about your body. We're all intertwined, we're all connected, and we're all love. And we're all here to protect each other and take care of each other. Love always, John Dowsing.